Hello and welcome back to the Morgan Branding Podcast. This year we thought we would do something a little bit different. We're going to record these podcasts and hopefully get them up on YouTube and TikTok. For those of you that haven't been following our journey last year, 2021, we pushed hard on TikTok. That's meant I've kind of let this podcast um, down a little bit. I've not been doing as many episodes, but one of my New Year's goals for 2022, even though I'm recording this before the New Year, so I'm starting my New Year's resolutions early, is to get back into the podcasting, back into some YouTube videos, and more content over on our TikTok channel. Uh, currently, as I speak, we're up to about 12,000 followers there, and TikTok has been a great success for us in 2021. So we're going to see how we can push this forward with more video content, more TikTok content, more YouTube content, more podcasts this year and see how we can mix that up. We are going to hopefully do some stuff with the podcast and get some other business owners on this podcast this year, finally. We've discussed that a little bit. Uh, we've got a plan in place, and we are ready to go. So in this series, we're going to talk a little bit more about podcasts and books. And it might just not end up as a series, this. This might interlink in more, because for me, um, and those of you that I spoke to know that I'm super keen on podcasts, but this year, year uh, 2021 for me, or, or last year, probably when you listen to this podcast, has been the year of, of getting more into books. And for me, not reading books as in the paper versions, but audio books and listening to books. And while I'm on jobs, while I'm doing jobs, while I'm clearing down my emails, while I'm traveling, uh, I'm always listening to audio books and podcasts. I'm not a huge mu music listener to her anymore. Uh, I did used to be when I, when I was working, but for now, the podcasts and the audio books are a great way to go. Now, obviously, it's task dependent if you need your brain in the task you can't have your brain in the task and your brain in the audiobook or your brain in the podcast uh, but there's so many tasks that we do do you know boring repetitive jobs or or clearing down our email inbox or, or whatever that we can be doing and listening at the same time some of the books that we go through this year and discuss do you know what books and what podcasts i've listened to you might go how the heck do you listen to, you know, so much or go through so much? And the reason is a lot of the time I'm listening in one and a half and two times speed, I probably listen three or four hours a day. And yes, all that information isn't going in. But if you've in my friendship circle or, or been out with me on a, oh, I was listening to this podcast and I said this, I was listening to this podcast and I said that. Ah, I find it a great way for me to, to learn. Obviously, I'm not digesting all the information. You all listen to podcasts now, so you're probably into podcasts. If you listen to some of this on TikTok or YouTube, I would advise getting into podcasts as well as the video formats because you can do podcasts or you can listen to podcasts at the same time as doing another activity, which as a business owner is key. This year, I've definitely got more into audiobooks. So this was on recommendation of several people that you should be reading books. You hear all these stats to go, you know, Elon Musk or... Uh, Jeff Bezos listen to what or, or, or read a book a week or two books a week um, and I've never really read I'm dyslexic I don't read I wouldn't take it in I've never been interested in reading but audiobooks for me have been a great way of, of getting into that so for me audiobooks are fantastic and the thing is or my difference between an audiobook and a podcast is an audiobook often talks about one topic a business book pick a book that you're trying to solve an issue from and we're going to go through some recommendations in this series but pick a book that um you're, you're trying to learn something about so for me i've got stuff about managing about being more efficient about um uh, not procrastinating about using my time better um pick a book on a topic you want to learn about and read it and, and somebody has gone to the effort of making sure that book is in a format or that information is in a format that's easily digestible. They spent a lot of time on a book, whereas a podcast right now, I've been thinking about doing this podcast series for a while. I've got some notes, but really it'll take me half an hour, a couple of hours to edit. So this series, I'm going to go through some books. I'm going to go through some podcasts that I listen to, give some recommendations. Most of these are going to be about business. I will maybe try and sneak in the odd informational one because I do like to mix it up. I can't just listen to business stuff all the time because I find it really intense. So enjoy the rest of the series. I'm going to, um, my, my first book I'm going to go for, for me, this was one of my best. Now, again, I listen to audiobooks, but for the benefit of the video, um, I've got some of the live books, which my staff have been reading. And this book's called Eat That Frog by Brian Tracy. And I'm going to cover that in the first episode. Cheers. What I started doing was clearing my three frogs at that point. And they call them frogs because they're the, you know, the, the horrible tasks in your day. And if you think about these tasks, they often...